On the topic of, you know, words that get you killed and um, things, you know, escalating through rap music. Yeah. Um, now, I don't know if this had anything to do with that, but I seen an interview where you mentioned that you, you got shot at and you got hit. Oh, yeah. You know. a, a few years ago, and people actually thought that you had passed away. Right. Um, do you care to tell us, you know, like, what actually happened? Well, I mean, it was like, shit, in the Bay Area or anywhere in California, sometimes, you know, shit, I mean, you know, they got, you know, they got Jack Crews and, and, and Jackers, they out, you know, you, you randomly get shot or jacked out in that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? And, um, it's fucked up, but you shouldn't even take it personal when it happens, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> because, you know, they riding around, you know, three streets down or two cities down, the same shit is happening to somebody else. It's like, you know, they sometimes they out jacking, some, you know, you slipping. Um, shit, it is what it is, you know. Um, I happen to, you know, not be slipping when the motherfucker try to jack me and shit. And, um, you know, the nigga shot and ran at the same time and shit. So, you know, I, I, I figured out I was shot and I, I was like, you know, I don't need to chase the motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? He probably, you know, I'm not a little dude and shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm like six foot one, 240 pounds and shit, and that, that dude was kind of small. I don't blame him for shooting me. I would have shot my big ass too, you know what I'm saying? Because I'll, I'll fuck somebody up, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> shit. So, you know, he shot and ran at the same time. And, uh, you know, if you listen listening, homie, I don't even blame you because I'm a big nigga. I would have I would have hurt you really bad. But, um. Shit, it's random shit happens like that. Either you, you might have beef. You know, luckily you don't have beef, you know, because it's not just getting shot one time when you got beef out there. You know, you get hit shit 30, 40 times, you know. I mean, I'm, I, I, I got arrested on a gun charge uh, back in the day, and it was like a um, shit, a 32-round clip infrared beam uh 40 caliber glock um uh the cop asked me what was i doing with the infrared beam on it i said i was gonna hit a motherfucker with all 32 shots i can't be wasting bullets and shit costs money you know what i'm saying <laughs> but I'm a, I'm a nice guy you know what i'm saying i don't i don't ride around fucking around with people and shit you know what i'm saying i just kind of i'm the dude who fuck up the big dude for fucking with the little dude you know what i'm saying <laughs> So I mean, you know, when you come down to shit like that, and you, your your environment, you know, it it just you gotta expect that type of shit. And you know, I grew up, you know, around that, and seeing like some crazy shit. So I kind of expected. I just didn't know when it was gonna happen. <laughs> shit, you know, after a few shootouts and shit, and you know, um, after you you done jacked a few cats and stole some cars, I mean, you gotta, you gotta think karma's gonna come back one way or the other, so I mean, that's kinda how I was thinking too, like, shit, I jacked a few motherfuckers and stole some cars too, so I mean, shit, you know, maybe it's karma, you know. So that was just a random jacking, that was nothing personal? Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't nothing personal, that was just random, you know. Uh, I think the, the, the cops, um, I think the cops thought that shit was funny, you know. You know, I'm like, fuck them motherfuckers. <laughs> when the one, when the, when the one that that came, he was cool, you know. Uh, but shit, man, I mean, shh. motherfuckers kept my jewelry, talking about it was evidence. I'm like, okay, well, they still got my fucking jewelry up there. Can I have my fucking jewelry back, police? Harry Police Department, please. Can I have my fucking jewelry back? Oh, shit. And so I take it from what you just said, then that's probably not the only time or the only incident. You know? No. <laughs> I mean, you know, you you know, you know, protect yourself. With, I mean, shit. I mean, after you see a few, uh, few dudes on the news uh, slumped over with, you know, with, you know uh, with blood coming out of their mouth and shit, um, you don't want to be the next... You know, what I'm saying? not trying to be next. You're trying to be aware. You want to be straight, but you also want to enjoy your life and um and and um enjoy the finer things in life. If you have, you know, if you got, 
you know, if you got the, the, the funds to buy them. If you got capability to buy them and have fun, then you should be able to enjoy that shit if you work hard for it. You know, if I want to wear a, a, a watch with diamonds in it and, and, and wear an earring with diamonds in it and a big gold chain and drive a, 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 a $100,000 vehicle, I should be able to do that without somebody fucking trying to take it from me or pulling a pistol on me or trying to kill me for it or whatever. But, you know, since I'm not, then I stay strapped too, you know. In, in certain uh, city, certain states where they let you carry firearms, there's less crime because everybody knows not to just run up on somebody and try to jack them and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, Texas don't have that kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? You don't just run up on nobody in Texas like that because it's probably going to get shot back, you know. But in California, there's no self-defense law at all. So you can't even wear a bulletproof vest. You just got to lay down there and get shot, I guess, you know. Is a, um, when you talk about the bulletproof vest, is that like a, a, it's illegal to actually be caught wearing one? Yeah, yeah. You can't even fucking wear a vest, man, you know. And I think that that's really fucked up, considering they can't control, they can't control a gun, uh, the, 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 the uh, people with all the guns, the crazy motherfuckers riding around here with guns or, um, um, you know, the, the kids in school who shoot up schools and stuff. Um, I think that, you know, kids should be able to, you know, sometimes shit, if they should be able to wear vests if they want to. What's wrong with wearing some fucking protection? Like, how can you consider that illegal? Like, it's crazy. Like, you know, California got some crazy laws, and, um, you know, as far as when it comes to self defense. And, um, like, you can't defend yourself. You just got to lay down there and die and shit or something. I don't know what it is, but, you know. Bullshit law. I wouldn't. I'm not gonna fucking just lay down and just die for nobody. <laughs> Fuck that shit. The, 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 the last thing. Oh, yeah.